are you calling? How may I help? My name is uh, Ryan Benson. On the Friday, I received an e email. Is this the Amazon? Yes, this order has been placed while using your detail. So let me check your system, uh, what happened exactly, okay? Mm -hmm. So let me connect your computer with us, okay? Let me find it for you, okay? okay. Now you need to type www.logmein123.com. Yes, I will give you that 60 digit pin code. Okay. You need to enter 805. It's all about the reputation of the, law, uh, the Amazon, you know? Yeah, I can understand. Because we know that we provide the best security and best service to the customer. Because you know, you are in trouble. If I will not fix it uh, right now, maybe they can harm your bank balance as well. That's the reason I'm worried about you. Do you want me to call my bank? Uh, no, no, no. I never did anything call wrong it. in my life. I don't know why somebody is stealing my money. Yeah. Don't worry and don't cry, please. Okay. I will check uh, yeah. everything. I will fix your issue. Peter they Smith, right? Yes, correct. Peter Smith. Okay. okay, thank you for now, sir. All right. Bye. Okay, bye. Oh, hi, Ron. Thank you so much for calling. My name is Ron. How are you? Let me just check what's what the best we can do here. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, stay connected. Okay. Thank you, sir. So now, as these people cannot get my remote access on the computer, so they tried the phone as well. This is the third, fourth call which I'm calling them and now they will do the blind pitch which means that without getting the access they're gonna ask for the money scare me tell me that somebody hacked into your computer and then they're gonna ask me to pay them the money you know to fix the problem which doesn't exist let's see how much they're gonna ask i know this guy who were who were speaking on the phone i trained him i when i was working in there i trained him completely uh, like he, he didn't know how to take the calls and other stuff, but now he is pitching for himself So that means he is promoted. Yeah hold on. The security that I'm just providing you this is the combo for all the security it comes with the anti-hacking tools anti -hijacking. And the name of the security is sonic firewall designed by NSA And what is the name yeah. of this software? It's the name of that is Sonic Wall Security. Okay, that going Still selling to, the shame uh, shit? Uh, like purchase it for you. And this security is designed by the NSA. How uh, much will it be? Originally, the price will be 3400 Okay, but right now, as I'm just a point. He's grown up. He didn't use to pitch more than 200 300 500 dollars so Now he's pitching me $3,500 because he thinks I'm rich. Okay. So, hello? Can you hear me, sir? Yeah, I can hear yeah. you. Just grab your checkbook. Is that be okay? You can write a check to the merchant directly because we are not taking a single penny from his side. So you can simply write the check to the merchant, okay, from where we are going to purchase the security for you. So you can simply write a check to them, okay, in the pay to section. Click 3 to LLC. In the merchant, you need to mention the name here, okay, that is Click 3. It's C like Charlie. Okay. L as a Luna, I as an Indiana, C like Charlie, okay. K like Kilo, okay. S like Sam, okay. T like Tango, R E E right? R E E S. Flex three L T. Write the amount that is sixteen hundred one six zero zero dot zero zero. Did you said you said first it's three four nine nine or you said it's one six? Nine nine. It's one. It's one six zero zero. One six zero. Okay. Sixteen hundred. Uh, you can simply uh, get uh, insurance for that. Okay, for your device. If any of your device get uh you know uh, crashed. Okay, during this like by these hackers or the hijackers. Okay, so you will get a new device for that. Okay, so you want to get the insurance as well. That means if okay. the device is damaged, you can send me new device. Yes, you will get a new device and from, Amazon. from Amazon. If the price, yes, that is for the two hundred and fifty dollar. So do one thing here. Just write the amount. Okay, that is uh, eighteen fifty, like one eight five zero dot zero zero. Okay, that is one thousand eight hundred and fifty dollar. 
Okay, in the memo, you need to write HQ, like S is in Henry, Q as in Queen. It's called Hybic. Alright, this is the company. This is something, it's a code for that security server. That's why I'm just. It's not the code, it's because you can locate the check. Right? You can identify it's your check. Okay. HQ. Okay. 1202. 1202 is his extension ID. Alright. Okay. And now sign the check. We want the check through the FedEx or the UPS. Okay, for the one day delivery. So the name is, address is gonna blow out uh, in California. Ronald Park. California. Right? Yes. Okay. You want me to send the UPS? The Yes, so just put the check into the envelope, seal the envelope and make sure you will do the one day delivery, okay, like for the express delivery. Over, overnight. Yes, overnight delivery. Once you are done with that, okay, please provide us a, uh, like the, the tracking ID for that, okay, okay, so we can track it. I will call you back exactly within two hours and I will provide you the tracking number. Alright, thank you so much sir for now, okay, uh, it's time to go, okay, so we'll hang out. After some time, alright. Uh, so, thank you so much. Have a good day, sir. Bye for too, now. You too. Bye. Bye, bye. Sir. I'm gonna fuck you up, bro. Asshole. We're gonna send the package this afternoon. It's a it's a box about this big, and we're putting a bunch of bright tape on it so we know exactly what it is. They are calling me again and again. They called me I think three four times. They left me the voicemails as well. So if you are if you're catching that mule, uh, but if they got to know uh, something is happening, something's running, then they will change the location or maybe they will shut down for some days. These people should not know there is something which is going on. We're gonna be at the UPS store when they open and we're gonna sit there all day until the guy comes. Um, and as soon as he comes, we're gonna go talk to him, we're gonna get everything on camera and we'll do everything we can to get him to admit it. Um, but at the end of the day, he will have our real money in the box. So if we find him, we'll call the police on him and we'll see, you know, we'll, we'll use that as leverage. I will have a tracking number for you in like two or three hours. So you can give it to them tomorrow morning, Wednesday morning. Uh, it'll be delivered by 10.30. That's great. Uh, so you're sending a uh, real check? Yeah. Okay, that will be great because we, we have the evidence that they actually asked. We have the recording, we have everything. I put a stop payment on it through the bank. So if they if they try to cash it, they're not going to get money. But it is a real check and it is really from... It, I, I wrote Ryan Benson on it for Amazon. Keep me posted. I'll get That's you the tracking awesome. number as soon as possible for tomorrow morning delivery. And uh, we're gonna, we'll make this happen, okay? And please just stay safe. I'm, I'm safe here, don't worry about me. I, I, I think this is- I uh, worry about you every year. day. That's like telling water not to be wet. It, no, uh, it's it's like, it, this is a big, really big moment for, for all of us, you know? It's been six months, I think, more than six months. And this is the only moment, this is the only chance we have to, you know, shut them down. When you got this package, are you getting to anybody this package? Because this is our package. This is your package? Yeah, this is our package, yeah. How do you and know? this is uh, Ryan Benson. Hey. 
that the person, this one, is him. This package you're picking up, I sent that. You did? Looks tree LLC. Yeah. Is that your company? Yeah. How come your company is stealing money from people? It's stealing money from people? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm talking about. No, no, I don't know what you're talking about. You actually, um, you know, we've been sitting for five hours and waiting who's going to pick up the package that we sent. We flew from Los Angeles specifically to see who's going to pick up this package. Uh, I just, I don't know anything about stealing money. Do you work for Click Street or is that your company? Well, it's my company, but my sales team is in India and they're the ones who send the checks to me. Where are the, who, where are those checks? What are those checks for? Because that's, those checks are stolen money from victims of an Amazon refund scam. We put that check inside, inside of these bags. There is a check from him. Yeah, There's for $1,800 inside. Dollars inside yeah. And uh, we're here to see who's picking it up and who's been I, facilitating this fraud for months. I have no idea about the fraud. Okay. I thought this was computer services. My team in India is was computer selling services. computer services. So people just send you money randomly for computer services that you don't end up doing? No, no, they do it. They, they have a, an office there. So you're expecting this payment? Probably in those envelopes too. I normally don't get boxes. Yeah, they we didn't. put it in a box so we'd know who picked it up. Because yeah. we wanted to meet you. Yeah, I, well, I, I'm more than willing to work with you to okay. find out what's going on. Well, and that's why, too. like, and, and we're that, need to get the cops here to sort this out. Well, that's why, this like, is actually. Mail fraud. Okay, uh, this is yeah. 100% mail fraud because there's my money in that box. Okay, well, I, I don't want to take anyone's money. Not... Well, you have been. Your company has been, whether you are aware of it or not. Yeah, I'm not aware. Click Street? Clicks, what is it? Click Street? Yeah. Okay. Has been the recipient of thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars from these Indian call centers that are scamming people pretending to be Amazon. You know those robocalls that you get? I have a hard time believing that you don't know about this, but let's just, I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. I don't get any robocalls. Well, well, millions of people do, and you know what that is, right? When you get a call saying you have an overcharge, and then they, they scam you out of money. What? Billions of dollars are stolen every year from Americans, and Click Street is one of the biggest recipients of scammed money in the United States. Your company is a money laundering, money mule scam, serving victims all over the country. Every time you get a check, it's from a stolen, elder, usually elderly person. Thankfully, it was me this time, because we're putting a stop to it. Well, we, again, we, we're trying to figure out if you're aware of this scam, or people behind your back, the people who work for you, doing shady stuff behind your back. Where does this money go? What do you, what do, you do with, these, with this money? Well, I just, I just put it in my bank account. But I don't keep it all. Like it, it, it Where goes it go? to, it goes to the teams in India that are doing the work. Yeah, they're doing work, all right. But I don't, I don't know anything about this. Honestly, I don't know anything about this. Seriously? Seriously, I, you know, they have. You get boxes of cash wrapped in aluminum foil and checks from people that you've never heard of. I never got any cash. Well, they send checks and cash. It depends I never on the scam. got cash. I never got anything that didn't. How did you end up in the first place working with that Indian uh, call center? Like tech, tech support Indian call center. Like, why are they working for you? Why did you hire them? Um, I just, I did some work with them a long time ago, and I was doing a game. Kind of a game. Game? Yeah, I myself was putting a game together, and they did some of the tech work for us. Okay. And Do you have a point person, like someone that you talk to that oversees everything? Yeah. Look, I, I can't talk to you right now, but let okay. me. We'll bring the cops then, and if you don't want to talk to us, we can't force you to do anything. But this is my mail fraud. It's my money. It's the actual real check in there that I wrote. And uh, so we need to sort this out, and this needs to stop. Well, I, t I totally agree with you. Okay. I so you totally can either work with us. I don't know. We can figure something out, sit down and talk, figure, yeah, try to get to the bottom of it. Um, otherwise. I, I don't really want to be filmed. Well, it's for our protection because, you know, you can understand what we're doing and why, you know. What, what are they telling you? I'm just like, trying to figure out if you're collecting those checks, right? Yeah. What are they telling you? That they're selling computer services. Um, e-commerce marketing. If they're selling it, why are the money coming to you then? Because they said it's in the U.S. Um, it's just easier if I handle it. Yeah, it's money laundering. I, I, I no, I'm just no explaining idea. it to you. That's okay. what it is. I, you know, I'm not accusing you. I'm just yeah, saying I, that this is this is how it works. They use they have mules like you all over the country. Some of them know, some of them don't. But this one was a big shocker because this particular address, we know because we have connections working in those call centers investigating it internally. So I'm just trying to figure out if that's your company, you have people work for you, yeah. either they're doing shady stuff behind your back yeah. without you getting involved. If, if this is true, then yeah, then it's behind my back. I can right? prove it to you. I have recordings I can show you. We like literally been getting ready for these bust we several weeks. Yeah. For this moment. Do you work for Amazon? 
no, we are. We have a production company. We investigate scams. We investigate scam. We yeah, we scam busters. So we actually go scam bait them, pretending to be that we victim, and we go and see where they live. The Indian call centers are pretending to be Amazon. That's the thing. They send out robocalls all over. I can play you an example. They say, you have to call us back. There's a fraudulent charge on your account. And they go through this whole rigmarole of connecting to your computer, and they say, okay, you have to pay for the security. So you have to send us money, in this case, to Clickstreet, so we can get this solved, so we can fix it internally from Amazon and fix the issue. So do they create the problem? Of course, that's what yeah, a scam um, yeah, is. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And that's one form of a many different kinds. You know, from fake it's social, security social security or... Social security scam, yeah. called, uh, car warranty scam, it's all the same kind of structure. But this one organization that you're working with is using you a lot. I would imagine you've received a lot of money from their sources, right? Well, I mean, I don't think it's you know, that much money, but... But ev every money. every dollar of that was every stolen dollar, from you mostly yeah. elderly people that don't yeah. know any better and were scared. There is a check it. for eighteen hundred dollars that we sent from Los Angeles yesterday, and while delivery is supposed to be today by ten thirty, we flew from LA to see to beat that check before you're gonna pick it up. So we can we've been sitting here since like with this car for since uh, eight thirty or uh, five hours, yeah, seven thirty in the morning, just to waiting to see who gonna pick it up the check, and we're trying to see what's going on and how can we stop this. Definitely, like, it's over now. We specifically put blue and yellow tape so we can unidentify our yeah, box. So right this isn't the first time we've seen this where they'll lie to somebody like you and get you in a system thinking you're doing one thing, but they're yeah. really using you to launder the money because they, they can't scam people and have them send the money to India. Yeah, so yeah they give they them a business address. It's easier to have, you know, like a US operation. Yeah, well, it's easier for them to scam people. That's why they're doing that. They use Americans. I'm very sorry about that, and I hope I hope we didn't like scare you. But like, it's it's just been this one in particular has been frustrating because this scam call center has been doing this for at least four months that we know of. We have a person and in India who helping us, who work for those call centers, and you know we have our intel's, yeah. and they are like, hey guys, the same address, San Francisco, San Francisco, and we're like, you know what? Screw it, let's fly and see because oh these PR bugs been, yeah. yeah, for how long they've been I working for you? I've known them for like 10 years ago is when I started the game. I haven't been doing this for 10 years. Yeah, are you talking about video like, game? game? So I, was, I was building a game, like a little app. Okay. Um, it's a long story, but I was building this game. I just like wanted to build a little app with my, my husband. And um, we ended up, it ended up being too expensive. We didn't finish it. But I, that's how I knew them. Like we hired them that way. Because I had hired a company in Austin to do it. And they were taking forever. I went down there to meet them, and I kind of saw that they were just being the middlemen to Indian people, you know, Indian subcontractors. So you guys decided to go to... Can I play you yeah. something? It's yeah. just audio, but it's it's a shortened version of one of the phone calls that led to this. Okay. And this is one of our, our... We have a team of people that, like, bait scams and just let yeah, them yeah. do their thing. So, like... This is Amazon, right? Yeah, sir. This is Amazon. Just grab your check. Is that me okay? Write a check to the merchandise. I can get your contact information. I'll give you ours. If we can exchange um, information, yes, let's do that. and then maybe I don't know, we can sit down and talk, or maybe I can video chat you like next week or something. But let's, yeah, um, let's... if you can provide the names of the people that are your your point people, so we can the one who works for you for doing, you know, whether they've given your real names or not, I don't know. But if we can just find out whatever you know as far as who they are, would be really helpful. And most most importantly, please don't tell them about this right now because we have a guy working with Indian police that wants to shut them down but if they find out that we're involved they're gonna move yeah they're gonna run away them. so we're trying to expose it and get them put in jail so this check yeah. is uh, well don't cash it there's a stop payment on it yeah well already call our bank um, but it is a real it is a real check so. <laughs> I can't believe you. Um, I'll just hold on to it I'm just like yes. in shock right now man I'm so shocked it's crazy. It's it's amazing we, how much effort they put in to lying to people at every layer that they have no idea what's happening really at the end of the day. No, so. and like I, you know, they just seem so steady and regular and always been like what I thought was super honest with me. Yeah, no. Know? They're very good manipulators and they're very good liars. Not to pry, but if you do have other checks in here, they're from other victims. I know, so you might wanna, like, I won't cash in. Yeah, we do a lot of live streams and we talk to them every single day on on our live streams and they they brag about 
how easy to scam Americans and it makes our like blood boiled they like yeah we scam for half million dollars we took like the whole uh, saving account of family they so happy and so proud how easy to trick us and uh and it's just like it's just crazy so it's just like a thing over there they're thinking you know americans are just like pushovers and some of them think that yeah you know, they all have their own reasons for doing it some of them are really vile but also some of them are doing it because they like the gentleman here i'm trying to get on the phone he's the one that kind of helps set all this up um, he used to work for them, but he was only doing it because he was lied to by them. He didn't realize it was a scam until and a couple months. And he was months. working right with He them. was working in the call center. In the call center, oh, with, no. without and even knowing. When they found out that he was leaving and was going to try to report them, they, to the police. they kidnapped him and they beat the shit out of him. What? Hey, can you hear me? Yes. Hey, I'm sitting here with Eileen. Uh, she is the, the Click Street. Hi. Um, Click Street is her company and... She, uh, her company's real. They do real, um, you know, a web design and, and stuff. Her relationship with the guys in India, she was told is uh, them, maybe you can explain it better, but them reselling computer services and she was receiving money for that. But she had absolutely no idea about any of this. Uh, I don't know if you want to say hi to her. She's right here. This is the guy that used to work there. Hi. I'm, I'm working in this company right now. This is a scam call center. It's really a big scam call center. And uh, they are using uh, your address, your company name to all, all, all these frauds. Yes, it's been a very long time, like they're using it, I think uh, yeah, more, more than a year. And this is a scam call center in India. I am working here right now and I know what's happening. And uh, this is total scam. So if uh, you can cooperate with us, you can tell us uh, like, how you, uh, they are using you, you don't know anything about you, so nobody will uh, like hurt you or nothing is going to happen to you, but we want to catch these people because they are the bad people, they are misusing you, they are uh, using uh, the people here as well. We, the people working inside, some of the people don't know that this is a scam, but this is actually a really big scam, it's a really, really big scam. You can help us, trust me. We will bust these people because they are scamming millions of uh, US citizens and stealing millions of dollars. We can uh, like make an arrest for them. Okay. 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 I um, you know, I feel kind of bad like putting her on the spot. I know she has her day to go about. Maybe if I can, uh, we can we're gonna exchange information. Yeah. If you can maybe write down those questions yeah. and she can answer them, she can text me or something like the amounts and the methods and stuff. And we're gonna head because we are catching a flight. But I will get you that stuff today. Okay. All right. I literally, nice work, brother. Johnny, much love. Much love, brother. Cheers. Bye -bye. I literally like looking at you, and like my heart is 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 broken. I see you tuning up, and uh, yeah, seriously. And you have husband, and you have family, and um. Have you lost any of your own money? No. Okay. No. So they literally been using your name, your name, and the name of your company. It's freaking globally on the, on these. Not your name. Your not your name. Your company name. Your company name. I mean, I just thought of it as a small, barely known, you know, company. No. Well, you're gonna do a really amazing thing by yeah. uh, helping to stop this money be from being taken from people. Um, take some time, process it. Maybe if I can just text you. Um, um, yeah. Let's my, exchange my numbers too. And not only put them in jail, but we can save more people from being scammed. And plus, you can save the reputation of your business. Like, imagine, like I said, instead of us, it could have been feds, it could right. have been FBI, right. Right. who literally will put you first and then it will start questioning you. Yeah, exactly. I remember, I mean, literally, like, I, we, you know, I just, I don't take anything, you know, no, when I, 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 we, I I've we been with the people who yeah. take things and I'm like, no, not me, no. I'm out, like, no. They're freaking using you. Yeah, and they, they and they love using really nice people. Well, I mean, obviously it's your mail, but it's, if you wouldn't mind, I don't know if maybe you can take a picture of them, the uh, checks, or yeah. if there's a name, even just the name or something of who they yeah. came from. I don't, I don't know. I mean, is that like breaking their privacy? Like, I, well, I, mean, I, just, I mean, I believe you, what you sure, guys are doing, yeah. but I also don't want to be like breaking any privacy. Just to make you more comfortable, don't even take a picture of the check. Like, we don't need any of the check information. I just want to know the, who it is. So if you can just tell me who their name, what their name is, and maybe yeah. you can know what state they're in, so yeah. we can find them and call them. So we can reach out to them and like, scam, yeah, sending money. Yeah. Um, just to help them, because otherwise, I mean, I don't know how much they send. Well, I'm not grand. cashing it. Yeah. For sure. No, but still, like, they will keep sending money. 
like oh. through other they'll keep like they will re scam people over and over. And over. They will reuse, they will Just gain like the trust trust trustworth, like the way like you have, and they take your you know like way and through you it's just like you became unknown a cash mill. You picking up these checks from innocent people, deposit in your account, on your account, not their account. They're using your name. Yeah, Taxes, yeah. fraud, FBI, everything is under, uh, under your name. Yeah. They're, not only, they're not even on radar. They're out of state. Right. Yeah, so you cannot go country. catch them. Exactly. Yeah. That's why, so that's what they do. That happens, like I yeah, you lose your business, you lose this and that. Yeah. But again, this is your day. Um, I'm sorry to ruin your I think it's not ruining. I think it's uh, we just literally save your business and and your. Now you know what's happening behind your back. Yeah, yeah. If you can just, if you just promise me one thing, just please don't tell those guys that anything is going on. I hear what you're saying. Like even just for a few days, like or a week or something, just because if, if they find out that this was a setup, they're, they're gonna, gonna go. They're gonna yeah, but they. More people a different way. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time. You're doing the right thing, and uh, and sorry that has happened to you. The... No, you guys are doing the right thing, I, and I want to help you. I just, I just need to. Yeah, you have to process. Take a breather. Um... All right. Well, All right. at least thank you for showing up at least at noon. Otherwise, we will. We're gonna be here just six o'clock. Yeah, just six o'clock, and then we have to catch <laughs> a plane. Have a free day. Now it's less. Now we can go and. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> One more time. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything. Okay. Here's the thing. I talked to an attorney, kind of explained the situation. I want to help you guys, but I'm like, I don't want to give out information I shouldn't legally give out, or, you know what I mean? I'm just like a little bit worried. He just said, don't talk to anyone until you talk to me. I said, I think that you're doing the right thing and you're exposing scams. I believe what you're saying. I do want to help. I just would feel better if I spoke to him first. I had a fucking feeling that was going to help. I totally She's do. not going to help. She's not going to help. Don't, don't give up yet. We'll see. We'll see. Take a breath. It'll be okay. I'm Your fine. neighbor cat can scratch your ass and an attorney going to be involved. If, if she needs to... Her lawyer will definitely tell her that you need to save yourself, so she's not gonna, you know, give us any financial details, money sent to them or something like that. Meanwhile, okay, an awesome job, Johnny. Stay strong, okay? It's gonna be alright. Alright, bro. Alright, guys. Okay, cheers, brother. All right, we'll you, see you soon. Bye. See ya.